So if your set-top box did not turn on or off, even after going through all the codes, and you've checked the position of your IR transmitter, then your box is not supported. What you'll have to do then is teach the remote control codes in WinTV for your set-top box. The WinTV application can learn new remote control codes. To access the Learn function, click on Advanced Config, and then click Learning. You will need to learn the 0 through 9 keys, plus Power On and Enter. Note that you will need the remote control from your set-top box to complete the configuration in this section. And keep in mind that this procedure is only necessary if you are using WinTV version 7. If you are using Windows Media Center, it will configure the IR Blaster as part of the Media Center setup. To learn new keys, hold the remote control from your set-top box as close to the IR receiver as possible. In the Blaster Configuration program, click the button you would like to learn, for example, 1. Then depress and hold the corresponding key on your set-top box's remote control. You will be instructed in the message box when to release the key on your remote control. Do this for the keys 0 to 9 plus on and enter. You should receive a message stating, learn key, key number succeeded. Then move on to the next key. If you receive a learn key, key number failed error, this means that the key was either held down too long or not long enough or that the remote was not held close enough to the IR sensor. You'll just have to try it again. Once you are finished with the numbers 0 to 9 and on and enter, you can test the learning by clicking the send button on the Blaster Configuration program. It will send the numbers 1, 2, 3 to your set-top box. Your set-top box should now be on channel 1, 2, 3, or 123. Close the Blaster Configuration program to save the configuration. And you're done! That's it! You should now be able to use the WinTV scheduler to automatically record shows from your set-top box. Well, that'll wrap up this episode of the HopHog product preview. From all of us at HopHog, thank you for watching. I hope this video was helpful for you. If you have any questions or want to learn more about our products, visit us and like us on Facebook, or you can visit our website at www.hophog.com.